In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace a broken tile. In my previous video, I screwed up, broke a tile, and now I've got to repair what I broke. Let me show you the next step number one. The first thing you want to do is get rid of the old tile. Now, if you have a full tile intact that you're looking to remove, I'm going to create another video and link it below in the description. You can check that out. But now, in this case, we've got a broken tile. Makes it a little bit easier. I'm going to move the large chunks out of the way. And now I'm left with something that doesn't come off. There's a nail that's driven down. Usually I like using a longer crowbar. You can stick it underneath here and get that nail removed. Now that this nail is out, this tile is going to slide out very easily. Depending on the type of roof, these nails might be longer or shorter, making your job easier or a little bit more difficult the longer it is. Now that we've got our old tile removed, we're ready to install our new tile. One thing to watch out for when replacing tile it's a lot of times difficult to find the same exact manufacturer or the same exact tile. You want to make sure the size of the tiles match up to the existing. The other thing you want to make sure is the channel. So we call this a one channel tile or a two channel tile depending on how many dips there are. So just keep that in mind when replacing the tile. So we're going to be lifting these tiles up and sliding them in place. Now, in the case of replacing a broken tile, it's very difficult, if not impossible, to get a nail and install it how it usually was. Because in order to install a nail, we've got to remove these tiles and now we'll have to put a nail in this tile. What I like to use is an adhesive. You can either use like a caulking, something like this, or there's a, sometimes a low rise expandable foam used specifically for tile roofs. Whatever it is, the idea is, we just want to stop this tile from sliding down. We like using M1, it's a cam link product. We found this to be a very high strength adhesive that lasts well under the sun. However, everyone has their cognitive of choice. We'll be creating another video. You can see the link uh, in the future on the best caulkings to use. But for right now, we recommend using M1 or a caulking of your choice. So I want to gently lift up the tile and put a generous dab of adhesive right underneath the overlap. The idea is to get it where two tiles sit on top of each other. So this tile is essentially going to be glued to another tile and therefore stopping it from sliding down. So you can see this adhesive is not really doing anything. It's not touching the tile. So either you want to make this a larger dab right here, or you can do it a lot on this lap, which will definitely grab it. So these joints are generally where I like to put a dab of adhesive. You can put one down here and up here as well. All that you're really trying to do is stop this tile from sliding down. So the steeper your roof, the more adhesive you want to use, the lower slope on a roof like this, we're not too concerned because gravity is not really pulling it down. 